Hi right, everybody, Chicago Area News, Steve Tobin reporting. In the news today, we're talking about Chicago's Police Oversight Agency has released videos of a deadly officer-involved shooting on the west side of Chicago, which happened on March 21st, 2014, in which 96 shots were fired into a vehicle in which 26-year-old Dexter Reed was in, and of course, Dexter Reed was pronounced dead at the scene. The shooting occurred around 6 p.m. on March 21st at the intersection of North Avers Avenue and West Ferdinand Street. Plain clothes, Chicago police officers attempted to pull over a vehicle and the man inside allegedly shot at officers prompting them to return fire according to Chicago Police Department press release. One officer was shot in the left wrist and transported to local hospital for treatment. No word on if he was shot by the deceased or another CPD gunfire. It is not clear whether the deceased Mr. Reed knew the individuals surrounding his vehicle were in fact undercover CPD or potential carjackers nor is it entirely clear if in fact Mr. Reed actually fired upon CPD. There was apparently no chain of command that directs who is in charge of the firing and stopping firing and how many shots were necessary when dealing with one lone individual versus an army of potential offenders. And according to news releases uh, from CPD, it appears that um, at least one, possibly more of the police officers on site actually went ahead and emptied the magazines for their guns and then went ahead and reloaded and continued to fire. So once again, 96 shots were fired into a full from a full assade into the vehicle and the lone person in the vehicle is of course dead and in response to the release of the videos several organizations plan to protest at cpd's 11th district at 6 p.m on tuesday so please go ahead and stay connected to subscribe to free emails and updates from me on this bet channel